welcome to a new episode of Baking with Caroline and Her Mom. I'm Caroline. That's Mom. Hi. I am in vast amounts of pain. Aww. So we're doing something kind of simple today. Yeah. It's a butter cookin? Boater cook. Boater cook. Which means? Butter cake. Yes. In and Yes. <laughs> it's a famous Dutch uh, recipe. Dutch is such a fun language because it basically sounds like English. <laughs> well, okay, vowels. yeah. <laughs> And huh. Okay, so the first thing we're doing is... We're not just, sorry, we're not just clearing our throats. That's okay, how you say G in... I can't do it. <laughs> you just did it. Um, <laughs> so we're greasing and flouring our 8-inch springform pan. Do yeah. you have to use springform? No, it calls for, um, it, the original recipe, which is old, called for a cake, 8-inch eight, eight cake tin. Like a round one or a square yeah, one? Yeah, round one. But, you know, springform is easier to get it out, right? Yes. And it's not going to ooze out like our... No, because it's very um, thick. Okay. Thick? <laughs> not thick. I have like a traumatic... Stiff. Traumatic memories of... Oh, the... Uh, the upside down cake. Yeah. The, yeah. That was... Yeah. Okay. So, a little bit of flour. Get a spoon. Oh my god, you guys. Okay. Flour. Sprinkle. Tap, 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 tap. Tap, tap, and then we... Go around the sides. Oops. I just swept and we'll sweep, sweep again. Okay, then you put the rest into the yep. garbage can or the sink. Into the sink, but I didn't want you to have to film me at the sink. I won't. I will just... We'll, we'll watch the fridge. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, fridge. Tap, tap, tap. Good. Right, now show us. Thoroughly floured. Well done. Okay, so we're going to turn the oven on, too? Yes. I wonder what temperature we're going to turn it on to. Let's have a look. <laughs> I think it was 350. Uh, yes, it is 350. Your basic baking temperature. Yeah. When in doubt, 350. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right, so now we're going to use the food processor. Uh -huh. It says uh, to uh, use the pastry blender or two knives, but in, in uh, deference to Caroline's pain, I, we'll, we'll make it simpler by using the food processor. So we need two cups of all-purpose flour. I get a cup measure. You didn't say cup measure. Oh, I did. I said it's over there on the counter beside uh, the. Yeah. You just weren't paying attention. I can't stop listening. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so two cups of all-purpose flour. I have a question. Yeah. These cups, they're nice and solid, but they have this little lip that like flour gets onto. Oh, that, that tiny amount of flour is not going to. In most circumstances, it's like okay. a quarter of a teaspoon or less, right? right? All right, so uh, then um, we need some baking powder. How much baking powder? One teaspoon. One teaspoon. Mm -hmm. The neat thing about this uh, recipe, traditional Dutch recipe, is that it has a lot in common with shortbread, except it's got an egg in it. It's like um, even more, it's even richer okay. than shortbread. Yeah. Shorter? Um, yum, yum, yum. I don't know. I'm trying to figure out what short means. Flaky. But is it like short, short on fat, short on flour? No, it's not short in that in that sense. It might be short as opposed to long. I don't know. <laughs> okay. We'll have to look that up and find out. Uh -huh. Okay, so uh, we did that. The, the sugar. Th two thirds of a cup of granulated sugar. It's right there behind your strong flour. Make oh, I'm sorry. Uh-oh, you're going to have to bend over. My silly me. I was wondering why there are two kinds of flour out. My apologies. Ugh. One, two, three. No, but there's stuff on top of it, too. Oh. Mm. Do you want me to come and do it? Oh, yes, well. Sugar has magically appeared. <laughs> How much sugar? Two-thirds of a cup. <laughs> Why don't we take the whole lid off and <laughs> tap the lid into the sink? Because <laughs> it's so much fun doing this. <laughs> Only ever remember it when it's happening, right? Yeah. From a rice explosion in the pantry several weeks ago. <laughs> yeah, and even still, we're still sweeping rice off the floor. Yeah, it was quite the explosion. Two-thirds of a cup mm -hmm. of granulated sugar. No rice. No, well, 
both. Preferably no rice. Yeah. Okay, so, so what do we do now? I think we probably... Uh, meh, 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 meh. We have to put, well, uh, put the lid on and zap it once just to mix those three ingredients together. Whoops, sorry. I was watching with my eyes rather than with the camera. <laughs> As you want to do. Yes, I am. Okay, now we need um, eight ounces of butter. It's, uh, the recipe says to use cold butter that's been out of the fridge for one hour. So it's semi hard. It's not squishy, but it's not hard. Yeah. Like it's, it's a little, it's like, it's like when you're testing avocados. Ooh, okay. Not that I eat avocados, but you know, that kind of like firm, but with a little give. Mm, sort of like with melons as well. Yeah. Eight ounces. Not that you eat melons either. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It's, you know, a cup, eight ounces. Oh, it's a lot. Okay. It's a lot. All right, it's a butter cake. <laughs> yeah. It's in the name. It's in the name. That's one ounce. <laughs> Tap it. Are you sure? It's not, is it fluid ounces that you've uh, got there? L-B-O-Z? Yeah. And L-B is after the colons? Uh-huh. And, and O-Z is, yeah, 1.9. <laughs> okay. A lot of butter, you guys. <laughs> and then it gets even richer with an egg yolk in a while. Five. Goodness. Yeah, yeah it was, I should have warned you that it was like it most was, of what was yeah, there. Most of <laughs> 7.3. Oh, we're getting there. Dramatic drum roll. <laughs> 7.8. Uh, Pop it in. Well, I would I would actually cut it into bigger biggest chunks. You know, some of those would probably be okay, but um, yeah, like that. What do you mean by that? You know, like those, not the windmill ones, but the... The almond, almond one? Ones. Yeah. It's going to be um, uh, shiny on the top because we're going to dust, egg not dust, it. egg wash it. Thank you. <laughs> not dust. You could dust it with egg. <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, so now we're going to uh, pretend like we're making pastry, really. That's what this is, right? Just let me... Uh-huh. <sighs> Taking a second to solid down our paint. Okay. Okay. So yeah. we're pulsing? Uh, are we awning? We're awning. Check it, see what it looks like in there. Little chunks. little chunks. Okay, so um, yeah. Really big okay, so uh, do some pulsing then. Okay. Um, uh, yeah. Oh. A bit longer than that. Jeet. Like conducting you, yeah. right? <laughs> Check it again. <laughs> okay. I've yes. got pastry, but with sugar. Sorry? And like sticking together? Oh, yeah. Just a big chunk of butter. Okay, so we're not quite ready yet. Dig down the bottom. No, I think it's just sticking together. 
yeah, it's uh, yeah, it'll stick together more once we add the rest of the ingredients. Yeah, I don't think it's chunks of butter. I think it's like. Oh, okay, sticking together. Sticking together. Oh, that's good then. All right, so we need to separate an egg and put the yolk in there. Oh yes, yes. remember <laughs> last week. Mm. Are people preparing for us to leave five eggs? <laughs> I actually had eggs for dinner that night. <laughs> yeah, there are only six, so... <laughs> you can do this. Just one. Yes, be careful. Oh. <laughs> it cracked, like, vertically. It went, like, voomp. Instead of the direction that one wanted it to crack. Spence is killing me here. I think I got it. All right, it doesn't matter if a bit of white goes in there. You just don't want any yolk in the white. That's it, yes. Okay. And actually, it's. Yay, look! <laughs> well done! Yay! Another <laughs> technique mastered. <laughs> this time. Yeah, okay. this time. Okay, um, a teaspoon of almond extract. Ooh, that's a lot! It's almondy. We're going to sprinkle some. Um, uh, Almonds on the top. Of the yeah. Top. I just know that you have to be really careful with. Extracts, right? Because they can be quite punchy. overpowering. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And a pinch of salt. Mm -hmm. Kosher salt or regular salt? Oh, regular. Otherwise, oh, I don't, I don't have know. Kosher. Isn't it over there? Mm. Oh, here it is. Just <laughs> hiding it. All right. Generous pinch of salt. That's good. Yeah, then we're gonna then zap it some more. Pulse again? Okay. Pulse, yes. Pulse. Zap, that's the microwave. Yeah, isn't you it? use zap for interchangeably for things. Yeah, sorry, pulse. Okay, so now you need to, uh, I'm sorry to have to tell you this. <laughs> uh, you need to put it on the counter, and yeah. Uh-huh. Well, let me just read what the recipe says. The recipe says, um, mix well or uh, grease your hands and knead the dough. It says or. Until it's very smooth. Or it says. Yeah, but it's not together. <laughs> it has to be got together. Okay. It has to be a lot. Yeah. Oh, there's still, I think it needs more. What's that? More, more, um, pulse. try not, don't, don't pulse this time, uh. Oh, it's on the edge? Yeah, it's yeah. on the outside. Mm. But I can, that can be... Scraped in. Yeah, worked in. Yeah. Push the machine over towards the fridge to give you space. Okay. Any flour on the counter? Or no, pretty, I don't. It's pretty... Get the red scraper thing out just in case. It's in the second drawer down. Okay. It was a piece of broccoli. Can you not like bend your knees? Or? No. Oh. There we go. Oops. Sorry, people. Okay. Mom's popular. <laughs> okay. So we're just pump, dumping it onto the counter. Uh huh. And we're putting what on our hands? Uh, grease. Like sure. Spray? Or you could butter your hands, but I think you'd probably find that gross. Yeah, that's gross. And also, I put the butter away. You're going to have to... Uh... There. Okay, so this is what it looks like now. Okay, it looks like that. Okay, what am I doing? You're pulling it together. shortbread as well. It's nicer if it's really um, kneaded. That's why they call it bread. K-N-E-A-D. <laughs> yes. I mean, we all always need shortbread. Oh, we do. Right? Yum. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it's like, it's just like pastry or yeah. shortbread. You yeah. don't really work pastry this much though, right? No, you don't work pastry this much. This is a you know when I make the Toblerone shortbread at Christmas? Uh -huh. 
beat the heck out of it. Yeah. The mixer. Yeah. That's why it's sort of legends. Okay, so this looks like it's uh, together. Yes. Yeah. Now we're going to pat it into the pan. Okay. It looks kind of Play Doh y. I it can does. pat it into the pan if you want. Okay, so we're taking our dough and we're popping it in the pan and then we're just squishing it to the edges. Uh huh. Caroline's fingernails. All right, they're short today. It's not my fault. I drink a lot of milk and my fingernails go really quickly. You drink a lot of milk? Yeah, in like latte form. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, now you have to make it level at the court at the edges, right? And then we're going to... <laughs> Look at that. It's all... It looks like... Um, the beach. Yes, it does. <laughs> good? Uh, sure. Yeah. Now we're going to... Don't say sure if it's not good. We don't want to ruin it. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, beat up the egg white okay. and... With a fork? Uh, sure. And um, then use... Oh, I'll, I'll get the, uh, the brush. Thank you. The brush for you. Yes. So I can you, do the top The top. You beat drawer, the egg. But not the... Why are we beating it? So it's a bit frothy. Oh. Otherwise, it'll just be kind of slimy on the top, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You get my. Yes, that's getting there. I think that's probably good. Okay. And then we brush it with the egg whites, mm -hmm. and then we sprinkle on almond slivers. Yeah. Yes. Not slivers, I forget what it's called. Flaked, I think it's called flaked. When they're thin, thin slices. You know, the other thing this reminds me of is the toffee squares, which we made, did we not make we them first? We made them first? like the second. Okay. Yeah, the first thing we made yeah. was Irish soda bread. Yeah. What about all the flour I've accidentally knocked off the edges? Mm -hmm. It's not gonna rise. Oh, okay. Right? And it's short bread. Yeah, so now dig out the uh, flake almonds from that bag there. Okay. Because it's got a, diff uh, a number of different... Kinds of almond? Yeah, treatments of almonds in, in that bag. <laughs> Our almond bag. <laughs> almond batons. Ground almonds. <laughs> Mystery almonds. Almond slices. That's the one. Tranché. Tranche. 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 Yeah. Okay, and then sprinkle generously. And well, how many do you want to in a in a piece? I like an almond. Okay, well don't you know mm, not as generous as you would be with cheese on a pizza. I'm not right. that generous. Yeah. But like like an almond tart. Yeah. yeah. Like almost there and all right. So now you're going, ah, I guess I'm going to put it in the oven. So <laughs> it's going to go in the oven now. Go in the oven now. For a, a specified amount of time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, Jesus. Just press this. No, I got it. 35 minutes until golden brown. Right. Okay. So we'll be back. Okay. So we took it out of the oven. It is, as you can see, a golden brown. Doesn't that look yummy? We're going to let it cool in the pan for 10 minutes, and then we're going to take it out of the pan, and then we're going to eat it. No, we're going to oh. cool it more. We're going to cool it more, says a disembodied voice from the uh, living room. So here it is out of the pan. As you can see, it, Mom was right. It didn't get any taller. It smells fantastic, like shortbreads and almond. Mm. We're going to have it as our post-lunch snack. So that will be happening right after this. Here we are. See? Just a second. Although it's been a couple of hours for us. <laughs> Do a close-up. That's what it looks like. Yeah. Oh, We're going to use our goodness. fingers. Yeah. Mm. Yes, shortbread. Yeah. Thick, mm. yummy. Almondy shortbread. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, so good. Like the butter. You can feel it when you pick it up. Yeah. Very lovely. And it's not super sweet, right? Mm -hmm. That's that's one of the nice things about it. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. 
Mm. It'd be really good for some jam. Kind of have a Bakewell tarty thing going on. Mm. Mm -hmm. We like a Bakewell mm -hmm. tart. We do. Mm. No. I think I got a piece of rice. <laughs> crunch. <laughs> I heard the crunch. You know? <laughs> I really must do something about that. Okay. So this is super easy. Super easy. Super yummy. Mm -hmm. And we highly recommend we it. We do. Even when your back hurts, you can make this. <laughs> okay, we'll see you guys next week. Bye. Bye.